Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video, I'm doing a what's in my work bag. This was my work bag when I had my other job at the TV station. It was my everything bag. And today I'm gonna to show you what is in my bag as a certified surgical technologist. And I still cannot believe that I can say that because it's wild to me that like, now I'm actually working as a scrub tech. So I'm gonna show you guys what I keep in here for just like every day going to work and stuff. So this is a Neverfull in the MM size and it's Damier Bean and it's Louis Vuitton, obviously. I love this bag. I got it when I got my first like big girl job and I just love it so much. I heard that they like stopped selling these because there's so much on like the resale market and fake ones. I don't really know a whole lot, but a sales associate there told me when I like walked in and they're just like really, really good everyday bags. Um, another one that I'm like looking into getting once I have some more savings and stuff is the Goyard tote because it's very similar to this one and I really like that one too. But this is just a classic and it's like the perfect size. It fits a lot as stated being the never full. I just really like it. I have the ballerine, the pink ballerine interior. And I just really like the dark brown and the pink because I just think it's a really good color combo. I like red, but I don't even like really wear a lot of reds or I don't know, just red's not really my color. I do like it, but not for like a bag. I don't know, just the MM size is the perfect size. So starting off, <laughs> I'm glad you can see the bag in the video because like I hate it when people are just like pulling up random items and you can't really see the bag. Um, so first off, I have a hat. I always try to keep a hat in my bag and bring it downstairs and put it in my bag before work. Um, I do have a spare hat in my locker at work, but I just always like to wear a different one every day. So. This is the one I wore on Thursday. This is kind of like what shows your personality and everything in the OR because like everyone has to wear a hat. So you'll see tons of different designs and they're such cute ones and people make them. If you go to like Joanne and you get fabric, I don't know. All I know is that there's so many versions. Next, I don't really always keep this in my bag, but I have a jacket and this is the jacket I wore at school. And it's just like a, Healing Hands, I don't know, is that the right name? Yeah, Healing Hands Scrub Jacket. And this is really the only one I have that's like goes with scrubs and it's this gray color. I really don't, I don't really like it anymore because it's gray and it doesn't really go with everything. So I really wish I got the black version, but I think maybe down the line, I'll look for a black jacket from Figs and get that one. But for now, like this is fine. I really don't care. And I can't even wear a jacket in the OR because like we have to scrub. So this is just, just in case it's cold when I'm like walking into the hospital. Next up, I have some notes on this tag and uh, it's a picture of a circumcision drawing and I just kept this. I should put it in my notebook, but I just have it in my bag for now. But this is like the little tag that you pull when you got a glove. Next, we always get a 15 minute break for breakfast. So I always try to remember to put a little breakfast bar in my bag. This is just a Nature Valley peanut butter flavor. And you guys know I hate eating like the first half of the day because I just, I consume a lot of calories at like dinner and lunch, so I don't really like eating, but you never know if you're not gonna get a break, so like you should have something. So during that 15 minute break, I always try to eat something. So this is good just for that. Next up, we have my keys, and this is so cute now because now I'm like actually a surgical tech. The little keychain that one of my classmates got us, it says surgical tech. Technologist, yeah, surgical technologist on it. So cute. Next, we have my wallet, and I just use this keychain wallet because it's really small, compact. I can throw it in my uh, belt bag when I don't want to carry a large tote. I can just throw it in that. It's super easy and convenient. Next up, I keep my badge like hooked on to this pocket right here. Like you can kind of see the inside pocket here. And I just keep my badge here. So this is it. I just have this little badge reel. It just has where I work on it. This is my little picture. It didn't turn out too bad, but bro, they could like work on the lighting in that facility. Like having your 
like overhead light casts such a weird shadow. They could work on that. Sticking with the back pocket, literally nothing is in here except for a hair tie. And this is the hair tie I always grab when I'm about to put on my hat. So I always know a hair tie is in here. Sometimes I keep my phone in here too, but I don't like keeping a lot of stuff in the back pocket because I just want, you know, to reach in here and find my hair tie to put back, like tie up my hair. So I keep that in there. And then I have my eye protection. It's always like good to have eye protection on because you don't know if like a needle or like bodily fluids are gonna get on you. So I got some stoggles and I actually got these as a gift. I do have another pair that my friend got me for my birthday, which are like pink and super cute, but I keep them in my locker. So I kind of just like switch off, but I have like a carrying case for these. And I got the clear version, so they're just like super cute and they stay on and they don't fog like those plastic ones do. And look at the little side, they say stoggles on them. And I don't know, just a lot of people, well not a lot, but like multiple people have this brand of glasses. If I can remember, like I'll link all this stuff down below. So if you are in school or whatever, you can get yourself a pair. They're not that expensive either. Cause like when I went on the website, they weren't, as expensive as I thought they were gonna be. Next up, I just have a pen. I have another pen in there somewhere, but it's always good to have a pen on you when you're at work. Got my sunglasses. These are a must when coming home, but they're just the hexagonal shades. And I get like some weird ass comments about these um, on my videos. Like the, there's this one guy, I swear you could like go back. I think it was on my Disney vlog. Like the person commented like, are those in like, I don't know what's in or not, but I just know I like these and I've been wearing these for like three years now. These are like my only pair of sunglasses. I mean, I have other pairs, but these are like the only ones I really wear. Next up, hand sanitizer. You never know when you might need this, so I always keep some in my bag. Another pen, like I was telling you guys about. Then I have my uh, glasses. I'm supposed to wear glasses, but I don't really. But these I wear on my way to work when it's like six, 5.45 in the morning when I'm driving just because I am really tired and these help conserve my energy because like, I guess, I don't know. I think maybe it's psychological, but they just help me conserve energy so I can like not have to wear glasses the rest of the day. So I just wear these when it's really early in the morning. I have my AirPods. I never really use these uh, in the OR or I don't even really know why they're in here. I should put them in my belt bag because that's typically when I need them when I go to the gym and stuff. I have this random card from Oxford Exchange. Oxford Exchange is a really cute place in Tampa. Like, oh my gosh, I love that place. It's one of my favorite places. It just says food is a symbol of love when words are inadequate. And honestly, I think that's really true. Can probably throw this away. Then I just have some wipes. These are like makeup remover wipes. And I just like to have these in case like I'm somewhere and I want to take off my makeup. So I don't know. I just find that just in case like always keep wet wipes in the bag. And these are just like a little travel size. Next up, I have a like food voucher for our hospital and it's like a $7 credit so I can get snacks. Next up, I have some hand lotion. My hands are always dry. So I have the Zoella Wonder Hand Moisturizing Hand Cream. And honestly, this is probably bad, but I still use it because I like the smell and it's like portable size. Next up, got the birth control. I just like keeping this in here so I know where it is. I got some floss because I always have something in my teeth or when I do have something in my teeth, like I wanna be able to get it out so I always have floss. Next up is this pouch and I haven't looked in this for a hot minute but I know I just keep like the necessities. That's pretty much everything in the main compartment. Like you can kind of see like that's literally everything but we'll clean out the pouch. So first off, I have some cash. I never really like keep cash, but sometimes when my mom's like, oh, here's a dollar, like, so you have cash, like I just put it in here. I also have like one of my business cards and I hand these out when people are like, oh, you do YouTube? I'm like, yeah, here's my card. I don't know, I guess. When I was in school for digital media and stuff, like. They always said, oh, have a business card. So this is my business card. And honestly, I'm pretty proud of this because I think it looks like pretty cute. Next, I just have some feminine products cause just always safe to have those. Next up, I have Tylenol. You do not wanna have a headache in the OR or like at work in general. So I always make sure to have this. And honestly, they taste like perfume because I have this perfume strip in here. So it's kind of like, 
gross but next i have a marking pen i think i got this when i was a student and i still have it in here because it's just like good to have a marker i guess more feminine products i have this adapter i kept this in my um bag because of school probably don't need it anymore but I'll just keep it in here because it doesn't hurt. But basically it's a USB port to a USB type C port. And I can just plug in my hard drive or anything to my computer, but I don't even have a computer. So this doesn't really need to be in there, but I don't know where else I'd keep it. So it's in there, a band-aid, a nail file. Oh, another hair tie. <laughs> but I have a nail file because you never know when your nails are gonna get like too long i don't know just in case you don't want to have like long nails because we like put gloves and stuff on so you don't want to like long nail or hang nail because it could like poke the glove another hair tie just in case i always keep like backups because you never know this is the perfume strip that i was telling you about and it still smells like baccarat so if you know the baccarat perfume baccarat baccarat i don't i don't know how to say it but i got a perfume strip of it because we were in Miami and there was a Baccarat store there. And I was like, oh, you gotta smell the perfume. So I literally have kept this in here and that's why it smells like it. And then I still have the coin from like one of my favorite days. My friend was Bitcoin and one of her coins fell off her costume. And my friend and I like picked it up and I still have it. Then I have this ring. It's just like a silicone ring. If I get like pins or something, which I don't really plan on getting pins, but Let's say I get a pen, I could put it on my badge using this. And this is from a saline bottle. And you just like poke it through and then you can like loop it on your badge. I don't know, a lot of people do it. So I have one of those just in case I get pens. And then I have this key. This key goes to the back gate because we have a lock on that. And basically that is what is in this little pouch. So that's pretty much it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, let me know down below what are your necessities to carry to work with you. I'm sure a lot of you guys maybe you work an office job and you always have like an iPad or something in your bag. I would love to know. And if you enjoyed it, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.